Thanks to its excellent gaming performance, the Ryzen 5 5600X works well in PC builds across a variety of price segments. For example, you can put together a capable mid-range gaming PC with high performance in 1080 and 1440p across the board. We'll be focusing on price to performance for this one, so that you can get the best value out of this AMD Ryzen 5 5600X gaming PC. Let's have a look at the specs. For CPU, the AMD Ryzen 5 5600. CPU cooler, the Corsair IQH100i Elite Capilex. Motherboard, the AS Rock B550 Phantom Gaming 4. RAM, the G Skill Trident Z RGB 16GB. For storage, the Silicon Power A61 TB PCIe 3.0 SSD. Video card, the MSI Ventus 2X GeForce RTX 3060 Ti LHR. PC case, the NZXT H510 Flow ATX. And power supply, the MSI MPG A750 GF 750 Watt 80 Plus Gold. The hardware configuration for this mid-range gaming PC is considerably more capable than our budget option. Of course, the Ryzen 5 5600X is going to hold up well, and gaming performance should be impressive thanks to the RTX 3060 Ti. We decided to pair the 5600X with the Corsair IQ H100i Elite Capelix Liquid Cooler. This cooler features a 240mm radiator, two ML120 RGB fans, and excellent cooling performance. It's easy to install, looks great, and will cool the Ryzen 5 5600X well for years to come. For the motherboard, we upgraded to a B550 option. The B550 Phantom Gaming 4 is not flashy, but it features Wi-Fi, PCIe 4 support, and a reliable BIOS. Also, PCIe 4 makes this cheap motherboard future-proof for years to come, so the Phantom Gaming 4 is by far one of the best motherboards on a budget. As for the memory, we're still sticking with 16 gigs of DDR4-3600 memory. This G-Skill Trident Z RGB kit features a low CIS latency as well. It overclocks well, and the Trident Z line is by far one of the best-looking RAM kits out there. You can easily add a 1TB PCIe 3.0 SSD for both Windows and all your storage needs in this build. It's interesting how cheap flash storage has gotten over the past few years. A 1TB PCIe SSD would be unheard of in a mid-range PC a few years ago. The exact drive we went with is the Silicon Power A60 1TB drive. This SSD is cheap, blazing fast, and quite reliable. You can't go wrong with a terabyte of flash storage either. For the GPU, we decided to go with the RTX 3060 Ti. This card features great ray tracing performance and performs well in both 1080p and 1440p. DLSS also makes this card more appealing than the AMD options. However, we do recommend finding an LHR, low hash rate, model if you can. These cards are cheaper because they're worse for mining but perform the same in terms of gaming. While video cards have gotten cheaper, the 3060 Ti could still be hard to find for a good price, depending on where you look. Now, we decided to go with the NZXT H510 Flow for the chassis. It looks great like the rest of the NZXT H series, but now features a mesh front panel. This case features a minimalistic style, and it has better cooling. Finally, we're using an MSI MPG A750 GF power supply for this gaming PC build. This is a Tier A PSU on the LTT PSU tier list. It's 80 plus gold, fully modular, and has 750 watts of power. It's an excellent PSU, and one that will last for years to come. Overall, this mid-range gaming PC build is quite an upgrade over our budget option. The AMD Ryzen 5 5600 pairs nicely with the 3060 Type, and we even have a motherboard with Wi-Fi. As for the rest of the components, they are also of high quality. Fortunately, you also get a fast PCIe 3.0 drive with this one and a B550 ATX motherboard. Performance-wise, this AMD Ryzen 5 5600X gaming PC build provides great frame rates in both 1440p and 1080p gaming. The estimated price for this gaming PC build is $1,100 to $1,200. So what do you think? Tell us what you would like to change. Check another video where we've suggested the best PC builds with the Ryzen 5 5600X and see if any of these is a better option for you. Tell us in the comments what you think and don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. Have an awesome day.